Buying a new firewall can be confusing. We get calls every day from customers that need help finding the firewall that best fits their business. And one of the product lines that comes up quite often in those conversations is the Cisco Meraki MX series of firewalls. And for good reason. You see, the MX series of firewalls are easy to set up and configure, they're cloud managed, and they provide top-notch security. So how do you determine which MX firewall best fits your business? Well, before you figure that out, there's a series of questions that you really need to consider. How many users are going to be connected? What levels of security do you need? How important is throughput to you? And these are all legitimate questions. A lot of our customers end up looking at either the MX67 or the MX68 firewalls. So let's take a quick look at both of these models and find out what the differences are and what model might fit your business better. So first, let's take a look at the throughput. The throughput for these two models are actually the same. Both models offer a stateful throughput of 450 megabits per second and a throughput with security features enabled of 300 megabits per second. Both offer 200 megabits per second site-to-site -site VPN throughput and both have a 200 megabit per second IDS throughput. Now let's take a look at how many users can connect to each of these firewalls. Once again, these numbers are the same. Both models are recommended in environments of 50 connected users, and both are also recommended in sites in need of 50 concurrent VPN connections. Now let's take a look at the wireless capabilities. Both offer dual WAN links, 3G, 4G failover, and built-in wireless. The wireless capabilities of both of these models are also identical. 802.11ac Wave 2, 2x2 multi-user MIMO, and 1.3 gigabits per second maximum data rate. So what are the differences between these two models? The MX68 has built-in PoE. So if you have devices like an access point that needs power over ethernet, you may want to consider the MX68. The MX68 has two separate PoE ports. The MX68 also has two dedicated RJ45 WAN ports, as opposed to the one that's included with the MX67. Another difference between these two models is the number of LAN ports available. The MX67 has three dedicated RJ45 ports and one convertible LAN WAN port, whereas the MX68 includes 10 dedicated RJ45 LAN ports and two RJ45 PoE ports. So if you're considering either of these models as your next firewall purchase, it should really come down to whether or not you need PoE or the additional WAN or LAN ports. So consider how many devices you'll be connecting to the firewall. Do you have multiple internet connections? Or do you have any external devices that need power through PoE? So if you'd like to know more about the MX67 or the MX68, contact Corporate Armor today. Our security experts are more than happy to help you find the firewall that best fits your business.